Hello Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome and welcome Cross Watchers. I hope you are all having an amazing day today. I am going to be taking a look and seeing what's manifesting for you at this moment. What's going on right now in your current situation with you, the person that is on your mind, if any. What do you need to know? Ooh. Oh my goodness. All right. All right. And if you are interested in a personal reading, I will leave all of the information in the description box below for you all. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on all social media, TikTok, Instagram. I am Spiritually Goldie on all platforms. Uh, I'm feeling a pressure on the back of my head, like the lower, lower part, so neck area. Let me know if like some of you are having neck pains of some sort, like the back of your neck. I'm hearing rhinestones, middle ground, hearing middle ground, Sagittarius, loophole. It's like you're you're going through some sort of loophole right now or finding out about a loophole, like an easier path, an easier way for yourself. Easier life. I'm hearing easier life. Your life is about to get easier, Libra. Like I'm hearing a soft life. So and this all stemmed from some sort of separation. Um, you may have been engaged in the past. I'm seeing a separation. And so... Um, either you were engaged or you just broke up with someone, separated from this person. I'm seeing there was a lot of fighting, not seeing eye to eye, instigator. You looked at somebody as being an instigator, only causing chaos and just being um, a hooligan. You've made some sort of judgment about this person, but I see that there, it, it, there was... You were left with some unfinished business. Like it didn't completely come to a closure with that world reversed. Um, but you view this person in the past as like wanting to move in with you or wanting you to move in or take things to the ne next level, not giving up on this. Meanwhile, you're like you saw everything you needed to see. You made a decision and you stuck with that decision. I'm seeing a runner. Like you ran away from this situation or this person because it was just um a lot of fighting bickering and just not peaceful for you i'm seeing that this person was was like an instigator to the situation i'm seeing you just weren't ready you weren't ready to face this person you weren't ready to uh communicate page of swords reversed or to have like a face-to-face -face conversation. Although I see you've been wanting to open up your options and just explore other things. Because you have options, Libra. You have possibilities in front of you. And I see you kind of feeling pulled in many different directions. But there's one in particular that you have your eye on. That you're like, this, this could be different. This person seems different. I'm, I'm picking up on you trying to change some sort of financial circumstances as well, but you're trying to take some sort of steps towards um, an opportunity that you feel like you may have missed out on before. And you're viewing somebody as trying to take action towards you, but not really listening to or their intuition. Um, coming out of silence as well. And it's not a surprise. Someone coming towards you and you're not surprised that they're coming towards you. It's like, what else is new? They've been like in and out of your life. I'm hearing Sagittarius. Could be a Sagittarius. I'm also seeing Virgo here. But it's just like, you just view the communication as being stagnant right now. But I see you have an eye on someone. You may be observing someone, watching someone. But you haven't rejected. I'm hearing... There's something that you haven't rejected. It's like still on the table. An offer that is still on the table. Even though like 
communication is stagnant, there's an offer that's still on the table. And you're thinking about it. Ten of Swords reversed. The worst is over. I'm seeing you wanting to have a new beginning in general and like get, getting yourself out of a slump. Walking away from a painful situation and putting an end to it for good. Focusing on your uh, success, public success. Pub I'm hearing public figure. You may be some sort of public figure. So let's take a look at this person over here. The hermit. They're very silent, quiet. They may have ghosted. They're they're coming up with someone something though. Like they're coming up with something behind the scenes. Uh, within a few weeks, they're thinking within a few weeks, communicating with you, talking to you. What are they thinking about right now? Like, why are they so quiet? Page of Swords reversed. They're watching you. So although they're quiet, they're observing you and they're watching you. Communication. They're thinking about... Um, whether or not to communicate with you, whether or not the communication style is going to work. But they're waiting. They're preparing to, like, to say something to you. Oh. They look at you as a magician. This person sees you as being someone who, like, you're very intentional or you're manifesting, you're great at manifesting, you're entertaining. The Wheel of Fortune, Magician Wheel. They see you as like being destined to be in their life. But they also see you making some sort of changes. Manifesting big changes in your life. Wanting, wanting some big changes in your life. But at the same time, they feel like there's something you haven't moved on from. So, I'm seeing right now, they're struggling with something. This may even be financial. I'm hearing uh, something financial is coming up for this person. And so they can't talk to you. I'm hearing I can't talk right now. They don't have enough willpower or they don't have, they don't feel like they don't have the power right now to keep a conversation going. But the actions that they want to take is the Nine of Cups. So within a few weeks, I see this person coming forward um, with like some sort of offer for you, a wish fulfillment. That, ooh, the Hierophant. Okay. It's like they're coming forward serious. They want to make something right and they want to do it the right way, the traditional way. They want to make some sort of commitment when they do come around. It's like right now they can't, but they want to come in in a few weeks with a commitment. Mm, Libra, you have someone trying to make a commitment. Even though they're not saying much, within a few weeks, they're, you're going to find out why. Marriage. This could lead to marriage. I'm picking up on someone new. For some of you, you may be speaking to someone new. I'm seeing wedding. This could like end up in marriage with you and this person. And I don't even think you, you're... I think you're, you may be expecting it, but at the same time, it will still be a surprise. I'm seeing a celebration, party, wedding. Mask. What's this mask about? Soulmate. <gasps> Libra. Oh my gosh, your struggle is almost to an end. Like, I'm seeing you've been trying to stand your ground, trying to protect your peace. 
but spirit is saying like you have somebody who is like who wears the mask or they they're not being completely true to like how they feel and it, this is a soulmate this person wearing a mask is like a soulmate what they really do want is like they want they see you as the end goal here a soulmate i see you marrying your soulmate libra i'm hearing first marriage like it's like when you marry this person it will be um it will be your soulmate ten of wands yeah your struggle is soon coming to an end it's completing itself and it feels like an uphill battle. I'm seeing a situation that feels like a struggle. But I'm seeing a commitment. A oh, responsibility. I'm seeing someone taking responsibility for something. Uh, being responsible. Wanting to be responsible for you. You end up making a decision. I'm seeing someone not wanting things to end with you. They want ten of pentacles. They want a long happy life, uh, financially free life with you. Commitment. I see a new financial opportunity also, Libra. Ace of Pentacles. Um, creative, something creative. I see you making a decision. I see you having options right now. You're going to end up making the right decision though. I see you cutting one person out of your life. But I'm seeing a, a big commitment. A huge commitment, like wedding. This is going to be a huge commitment. It's Ten of Pentacles. This person's coming towards you, like, not only committed, but financially stable. So I'm getting a sense that whoever this person is... They're focusing on their finances because they see you as the end goal, but they want to be stable for you. Empress. You are an empress, Libra. You are wife or husband material to someone. I see right now you may be on the fence, but there's a magnetic attraction. I'm hearing a slow burn. It's a slow burn, though. It's, it's going to be a slow burn. But it's, there's definitely going to be that magnetic attraction. Because I'm seeing you're kind of on the fence. Something is like not growing or stagnant right now. Spirit is also asking you to um, nurture yourself. Focusing on you and your self-love in the meantime. Stepping into your femininity. Your empress. Nurturing you. Because you're about to have a big, uh, a big commitment to make, a huge commitment to make, whether you're ready or not, <laughs> ready or not, like here I come is what I'm hearing. So let's get some numbers. I'm seeing seven, 10, five, um, 81, 32, 28, 97, 63, 52, 45, and 33. So those numbers may be significant. Let's get some letters. I'm seeing S, M, P, W, R, S, E. Um, so with that being said, this is what I'm gathering. If it resonated, let me know. And if you made it this far in the, vi in, in the video, thank you so much for watching. And... Again, if you're interested in personal reading, all of that info is in the description box below. And with that being said, I hope you have an amazing and blessed rest of your day, Libra. Bye.